Welcome back to my channel guys. I am showing you how to adjust mileage or mileage correction on Mercedes Sprinter van truck or bus from 2006 onwards or W906 chassis. It's the same chassis of Volkswagen Crafter as well. This is part 1 video where I will show you only speedometer mileage adjustment only. In the part 2 video will be shown that how to adjust mileage on key module. It's very important to adjust same mileage on key module as well at the same time. Because if you just adjust or correct mileage on speedometer then key module will send the original or previous mileage to speedometer to override. I have already uploaded an other video which shows that how to remove speedometer and key module of this vehicle easily. The link is below in the description. To disassemble the speedometer, please remove the back cover, as showing on screen, there are few clip locks which are holding the back cover. Carefully remove the speedometer PCB. There are no clips to hold this inner cluster dials. Now pull out the trip buttons with knobs which are just sitting on left and right of this cluster. Now it's time to remove needles. It's very simple, just hold the needle front pointing side with one hand then use a spoon to lift the needle with pushing down to spoon from other side. Please watch as showing on screen, it's very simple but do it with care. Please make sure that you move all the needles pointing to zero. It will be easier to put these needles back. Turn the upside down of this cluster and remove the LCD ribbon, it has two locks in left and right of this ribbon. After removing the ribbon, carefully lift the PCB with removing the small plastic locks which are holding this PCB on its casing. Find the IPROM chip, which is number 25 LC6401, as you can see it on screen. Please must mark it to pin 1, and also a mark on PCB showing its direction before to remove it from PCB. Because if you fit it back upside down after removing it then you will burn it, or it can be big problem for you. The pin 1 is always on bottom left on this kind of IPROM chip and the arrow mark is indicating the direction of fitting of this chip. It's a very good practice to do so. Now turn on the hot air blower to set its temperature up to 500 Celsius. Now point the hot air blower direct to chip with a short distance. Please make sure that air pressure is very low. Because the hot air will melt soldering on other small components and they will fly away. After 5 seconds of heat use a metal picker to pick this chip and then carefully lift up to remove it. Please be very careful here. Because if you move your picker tool while lifting or removing the chip from board, then there are chances to touch other little parts, which can be removed by mistake. It can be difficult to put them back because of their small size. Now use the clip with matching the pin 1 of chip. 
The red cable side is pin one of the clip. Then other side of connector put on the board of dash fixer machine. Please use the board which is on screen and be careful again to match the pin one side on the board and cable connector as showing on screen. Connect the M-Plex to dash fixer machine and then board to M-Plex. Turn on the dash fixer machine and go to Mercedes Sprinter menu. Then select the option as showing on screen. Next step to choose one option from three options. First two options are for dashboard or cluster. It has version 1 and version 2. We will go to V1 to try. It should read correct mileage. If the version 1 is not showing correct mileage then go to version 2. Click on program button to read the IPROM. It will show the data as showing on screen. After reading the dataset, the machine will show the mileage in kilometers. Please match it with your original mileage. If these number are far different or very high as compared to your original dataset, then please click on back button and try with version 2. I am going back to main menu to try in version 2 because the mileage showing is far different. Please follow the same steps for version 2. After reading the IPROM in version 2, I can see that it's showing mileage in kilometers and matching to my original mileage which was on the vehicle. Press the C button to convert reading into miles. Now save this file for just in case if you lost the chip or for future reference. The saving of file is very good practice. After saving the file you will come to this menu where you need to click on change mileage. Now enter the new mileage here on this screen and the press OK. It will take couple of seconds to write new mileage data onto the chip and will show message of data equal. Press OK. It's confirmed that mileage data has been changed in previous message where it said that data equal. But still if you wish to make it sure then press the read button from this menu. After reading the data set. Now you can see that it's showing mileage what you just wrote it a minute ago. Press back button from screen and put the chip back to cluster in same opposite when you removed on first step. That's it. Job is done to speedometer. Please note. This is part one video. You must need to change same values in your key module as well. Because if you just adjust with speedometer, then the mileage will go back to previous mileage data. The key module will overwrite the original data set to speedo cluster. Please make sure you watch the part two video. That very important video. Thanks for watching Universal Information and Entertainment TV.
Please like and subscribe our channel for more updated videos, news, information and entertainment. See you in next video. Stay tuned.